Hi, I'm Megan Gill and I want to talk to you today about pet portraits. I get a lot of people asking me, how do I get started with a pet portrait? So I wanted today to, to walk you through how you would go to sign up for a pet portrait. But before I do that, I want to talk to you about what it actually is. So this is an actual pet portrait in progress. And one of the things I want to show you is, is that it's on this hard wood. And so it's called Aquaboard and it automatically will, is archival. And the other thing is, is that the watercolor goes on it and stays on it really, really well. The other thing that I do is I spray it with a UV protection so that when you pop it into an actual frame, you don't have to put this in glass and that it's fully pr protected and everything. Now, let's get started and let's talk about actually how you would go to sign up for a pet portrait. Just come to my MeganBaileyGill.com and you can actually go in and you can scroll down and there it says pet portraits, find out more. This will take you to MeganBaileyGill.com and go to the pets. So it tells you about all the pets and all the different sizes that I do. And the first thing that you should know is that it takes a $30 deposit up front for me to start your pet portrait. When you go to do this, you do not need to know what size. You do not need to know what picture that you're going to use. So it goes through all the prices. And one thing I want to point out is that if you have more pets than two, then you automatically go up to an 11 by 14. So only one pet is on an eight by 10. 11 by 14, there is a three pet maximum and each additional pet will be $45 in addition to. So let's say you have two, you've got 95 plus 45 and that's gonna be your total. Now, what to expect is what I just told you about the flat panel and how that actually comes. And then I have some good pet photo tips. So one of the big thing about it, you sending me photos of your dog or pet, is that I really, really want natural lighting and a close up of your dog or pet's face. I'd like it to be clear and I'd like mostly show a little bit of personality and have really, really good lighting. Now, if you have more questions, you can come down here and you can actually in, send me an inquiry or an email and fill this out and say, hey, I have this. Can you do this? The chances are, is yes, I can do it. And then you're going to come in here and you're going to actually go ahead and sign up for the $30 deposit. If you want to go ahead and buy all of it, you could come in and you can actually add uh, that to your cart. But a deposit is all that's required. Now, after you've decided and you filled out this step, I will send you to the pet information form, which technically could be your next step too. When you come to the pet information form, you'll notice that it goes ahead and you can fill out this form and it helps me keep up with you. So let's just do a little one real quick. So there's all my information and my email. And yes, I would love for you to say yes to actually mailing me so I can be on my newsletter. You're going to do the type. You're going to call Lily. The puggle. The size of the pet portrait, you get to actually choose. Notice that it actually gives you all the options that you're going to do. We're going to just say an 8x10 for $75. I ask if it's a memorial for a pet, and this pet is actually, yes, a memorial. Is it a gift for someone else? Yes, it actually is. And is there a specific date you need it by? Well, let's just say May 1st. All right, you can pay your deposit multiple ways. So there's at the Basement Marketplace, the Artisan Hatchery, but right now, if you are on my webpage, you're gonna pay a $30 online. So we're gonna go ahead and click that. You're gonna say that today, you can say, I don't know, by the way, uh, today, All right? And if you are a repeat customer, you can get 10% off of the final total bill of your actual pet portrait. But let's just say I'm not. 
And then I give you a few options of how you can give me your photos. You can text me the image. You can email me the image. You can also attach the photos to this file folder right here. And then some people have already texted me, and that's when we have the next three. And then you can even say you're still working on getting your photos together. Either way, me and you will work together to actually figure out what the best pet portrait is. And again, it gives you another link right here to YouTube that will actually teach you how to take a good picture of your pet. And then you're going to browse your folder and you can actually go in and um, upload your actual thing, your pet. And then it tells me, thank you right there. And at that point, you're finished and I will contact you. And that is how you sign up for a pet portrait. And I hope that you sign up for a pet portrait soon so you can have your pet and give that special somebody the gift that they want. I'll look forward to seeing you soon and seeing your little furry friends. Bye.